kids in the Davenport School District stayed home today. A lot of parents are upset, though, about it. The district notified them earlier today and announced on Facebook that classes were canceled today. It blames a bus driver shortage and COVID-19 related health concerns for keeping schools closed. Local force Kennedy Cook joins us live in the newsroom after speaking with one parent about it today. Kennedy. Jim, Davenport parent Cassandra Upshaw drives her children to school herself, which was an even more upsetting reason to her that she heard classes were canceled today. Cassandra told me that she wished that school hadn't been canceled, allowing for those students able to attend the opportunity to learn today. She added that the bus driver shortage was not a shock to her. Rather, she hoped for better planning with Davenport schools. And while you would think some kids would be excited for an extra snow day, Cassandra says her children were more excited to get back in the classrooms. It's just upsetting because um, kids are missing out on a crucial day of, of learning. And you know, the school got canceled because of the bus shortage. You know, I think they should have still had school and whoever could show up could show up and whoever was having transportation problems, if they couldn't find alternative transportation for their child for school, then, you know, they would have just had to miss a day. Now we did reach out to Davenport Schools, who confirmed schools will be in session tomorrow and have a plan in place moving forward. We will hear more from the plan from the district superintendent on Local 4 News at 5. In the newsroom, Kennedy Cook, Local 4 News. Kennedy, thanks for that update. School districts across the country are making other adjustments with kids back from winter break to deal with the pandemic. Several districts reimposed mask mandates, social distancing requirements, and more testing for COVID-19. Chicago Public Schools will buy more than 100,000 laptop computers in case students go back to remote learning. New York City is gearing up by giving 2 million at-home COVID-19 testing kits to students. Local hospitals are still treating dozens of patients with COVID-19. Genesis Health System has 60 patients hospitalized right now with the coronavirus. 11 of them are in the intensive care unit. Unity Point Health Trinity has 92 patients hospitalized with the virus, and 26 of them are ICU cases.